You have got this idea that I am the body. He is the kami, the sensuous man, who is a desirer of endless objects outside. Why? To do puja to the body. Sharira puja. And then give me some coffee and a chocolate. A chocolate is all over. Moompali. <laughs> Moombali also is over, all right, chewing gum. Yeah. <laughs> chewing gum may kya hoga? No, practicing. So that when food comes, when real food comes, I should not forget how to eat. So keeping practicing. Yeah. That's the other thing. Once you understand, I am the body, the sensuous demands one after another. And that such an individual is called a glutton. And if he's eating, or a very sensuous man who is running after the sense of this. Who? He who has the misconception that I am the body. Thereafter, it is logical that he is trying to make the body comfortable. It continues. One after another, endless demands. Vilakshana kama yada katham syad. What is the lack of thinking? This self, the Atman, needs something vilakshana, something other than the body. The body is an object aware, and the consciousness, the infinite, the reality, the subject, you, is the consciousness that is knowing the body. How can the subject be the object? So you, since the Atman, the self, you, is something other than the body. How can? What is the logic that you are a Kamayita? You have entertaining desires. This is for what? Desires for security, for pleasure, for comfort. Hare, for whose security? Whose comfort? The body. But who are you? You are the subject, not the object. Katam siyad. How can it be? Ato, therefore, artha sandhana paratvameva. Artha, objects. Sandhanam, continuously thinking of the sense objects. That condition of your mind, that habit of your mind. Artha Sandhana Paratvameva, underline. It cannot be described better. Artha Sandhana Paratvameva, that alone is Veda Prasaktya that creates in you the concept of plurality. Veda, this I like, this I don't like. This is nice, that is not nice. These are my people, they are their people. This sense of plurality comes in when you are arthasandhan. You are recognizing the world of plurality and constantly spending all your thoughts only in thinking of them. So such a mind, the world is of divided into distinct things and beings. The multiplicity of the world becomes self-evident to you. Bhavabandha Hetu, the one source and cause for all your bhavabandha, your bondage to the realm of change. Bhava. Constantly everything is bhavana. Bhava. Everything coming and coming and coming and going. And you are living in that. Constantly in sorrow. In between, <laughs> smile. And <clears throat> thus you are tossed up and down. Why? Because your mind is tuned up to the ever-changing realm of multiplicity and plurality. Artha. <coughs> Sandhana para. So this artha sandhana paratvam eva, this habit of constantly thinking of the sense objects, how to get it? Without that, what is life? It's useless. This is the cause for your continuing the egocentric experience of constant change. Our bandha, uh, 